Hello again, I'm Trisha from Real Fluency Now. And if you haven't watched the first video from me in this playlist yet, then you should watch that first. You can get to that right here. Now let's briefly review all 10 expressions that I did in the first video. Number one, sign of the times. This means something typical from a specific time period. Number two, turn away. This is a phrasal verb meaning to not let someone in a place or not look at them. Number three, open arms, to welcome someone completely. Number four, take it easy, to be relaxed and calm. Number five, true colors. This means um, what kind of a person someone really is. Number six, time after time, when something happens a lot. Number seven, Ride the storm out. This means to wait for something bad to stop. Number eight, go crazy. This can mean to become insane or to have a lot of fun. Number nine, poker face means to not show emotions on your face. And 10, winds of change. This means or refers to big changes that are coming soon. Now it's time for some practice exercises. With these, just fill in the blank to finish the idiom or expression that I started and that I just reviewed and taught you in the first video of this playlist. Number one, the political situation here is really bad now, but we need to just ride blank until the investigation is completed. Number two, he was so happy and in such a good mood that he went blank at the party. Number three, turning on the TV and seeing another school shooting is a sign blank. Number four, you shouldn't turn blank people who are suffering. Number five, I think the winds blank have begun to blow on gun violence in the U.S. Number six, his family welcomed me with open. Number seven, after all the stress I had last week, I really need to take blank this weekend. Number eight, I didn't want him to know how excited I was to talk to him, so I tried to keep a blank face. Number nine, he thought she loved him, but then showed her true blank when she left him after he was sick. Number 10, time blank. He dates women that are wrong for him. The full sentences with the blanks filled in are in the description for this video, so you can check your answers. I had fun making these videos. I hope you like them too, and I especially hope that you learn some English from them. So please tell me in the comments if this was helpful or not, and if you would like for me to make more videos like this. And like usual, if you have the time, Please stay and watch more of my English lessons here on YouTube, and please subscribe to my channel. Goodbye, and remember, with hope, anything is possible.